Pisceans, hello, it's your girl here, Miss Hawaii, and this is your general love reading for October 19th of 2021. It's so good to see you guys. I hope all is well with you and your loved ones, and welcome if it's your first time here, or welcome back to Miss Hawaii to Row. All right, if you, as you saw in my intro, personal readings, you can email Miss Hawaii Readings at gmail.com. That is Miss Hawaii Readings at gmail.com for personal readings. It does take one to two weeks to get you the reading. If you would like it expedited, you can pay an expedited fee and I will get you the reading within 24 hours or by the next day. So that's Miss Hawaii Readings at gmail.com. I look forward to hearing from you guys. If you have time, follow me on Instagram. My Instagram name is Miss Hawaii Toro. That is Miss Hawaii Toro. And there's also a Facebook link included below for you. If you could be so kind to go ahead, sorry, I'm getting your decks for the reading. If you would be so kind to go ahead and um, like that Facebook page, I would greatly, greatly, greatly appreciate it. That is a way of showing your support for the channel. And uh, don't forget to always like, comment, share, and subscribe. I would really, really, really appreciate that. Hold on, y'all. Sorry. I dropped something here and I'm like, oh, no. What else did I want to say to y'all? Um... Oh yeah, in the uh, description box you will also see I've included a Miss Hawaii birthday wish list. I know a few of you guys emailed me and asked about the wish list. Um, some of you guys wanted to get me a, a gift and I appreciate that. My birthday is not until Halloween, October 31st. But I did get your emails inquiring about, you know, wanting to send me a gift. And of course I can't put my, um, <laughs> I can't put my um, address online. So Thank you for all the uh, um, members and watchers that emailed me and gave me the suggestion about the Amazon wish list. So I finally was able to create one. The link is in the description box if you want to give me a birthday gift. I would appreciate that. You don't have to do it. You know what I mean? Um, your love and your support is enough, Pisces, just being here with me, liking videos, even comments. And watching and just giving me your good energy is enough and that's the best birthday gift of all but i know there are some of you who want to show some gratitude so the link is in the description box below as well as the, the link for the extended reading where i will pull your person's cards see how they feel about you pisces what actions they'll be taking moving forward towards you okay if you're not a member yet click that join button for membership access all right you get access to private readings that are only accessible for my members okay so thank you for all your positive energy thank you thank you thank you shout out to all the members and um let's get into your reading now okay don't forget follow my um subscribe to my other channel which is miss hawaii scorpios all this information that i talked about in the beginning of the video is in the description box okay so let's see how is pisces feeling in love what's going on with pisces in love let's see pisces how you been feeling in love, Pisceans? The High Priestess. Oh, shit. I think that's your major right there. Aren't you the High Priestess, the Pisces? Oh, shit. All right. I like that. Very intuitive. You've been feeling very intuitive. I'm getting there's a Pisces that's been having a lot of dreams. Like some of you guys have been dreaming things, like your dream, and then, oh, what, what popped out there? The Emperor in reverse. Ugh. Yeah, for some of you Pisceans, you like will see something in a dream and the shit will come too. So you've definitely been in your power, uh, but very intuitive, picking up on things, even in this connection, this love connection that you're in. I feel like you've been, you can kind of read this person's thoughts. Sometimes they say or do things and you pick up on it. The world is here. Oh, shit. There's that little moon crescent moon thing I'm seeing. Yeah, so some of y'all pay attention to your dreams. Um, I feel like your dreams have been definitely delivering you messages there. Um, the eight of cups. Wow. Eight of cups with the world. You walked away from something or you close out a cycle here. Yeah, and there's that moon again. Some of you guys, and you went from within and something told you to let this go. Um to walk away from something, to let go of this energetically. How did your person feel? The tower. Whoa, you got some intense energy here, Pisces. First of all, you got one, two, three, four major arcana cards already. How does this person feel? Something crazy happened here, Pisces. Something told me to do y'all reading too. Three of wands. 
Wow. What is that? Two of Wands. Okay. One more card for how this person feels about Pisces. The Chariot in Reverse. Cancer Energy. The overall energy for the read is the Page of Wands. A message. Communication. Um... Some of you guys are dealing with a fire sign, getting fire sign, Cancer, Scorpio, uh, maybe another Pisces, Aries. All right. So let's go ahead and clarify, get down to the nitty gritty and see what's going on here, Pisces. Um, not going to lie. Um, I feel like something crazy happened here with the tower something could have happened unexpectedly between the two of you guys and i see you ready to move on ready to walk away abandon this trying to close out this cycle um let's see the high priestess some of you guys this person could have either not been um take put in the in the initiative and the work and the responsibility here in this connection they could have been trying to control it in a manipulative way um, or they could have just been downright immature because the emperor in reverse, that's what that represents. Six of cups, ten of cups. Some of you guys, it's somebody you've been dealing with for a while or somebody from your past here. And they're just not turning out to be your wish fulfillment. Show me the high priestess. Let me see the high priestess. Four of pentacles. Two of Swords in reverse. Some of you guys have been struggling with this decision for a while. You had to go from within. Six of Cups again is here in reverse though. With the Eight of Wands in reverse. Yeah, shit just wasn't flowing the way you wanted it to flow. Um, point blank period. Uh, I feel like you finally made a decision here. It was a tough decision for you for a while for some of you guys. And... Um, the decision here was to kind of try to release this because some of you are holding on to it possibly because you've known this person for a long time there's a lot of history a lot of good moments so i feel like it was hard for you for a while to let go of this or make this decision um you were, this could have been something you were holding on to for a very 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 long time um let's see the emperor in reverse song right here show me the emperor in reverse three of swords oh this person broke your heart some of y'all it's a third party situation seven of cups oh wow wow i love your read pisces because it's like very straightforward today um i feel like you wanted this to work you wanted this you had a lot of hope and faith in this this is something, this is somebody you really, really cared about. Some of y'all, this is somebody who's famous or somebody who's in the public eye or just somebody who a lot of people are attracted to or want, like they're very, very known or something like that. Rico Suave or Rika. But I feel like this person has hurt you. I feel like this person has hurt you, Pisces. Three of Swords here. Some of y'all, it's because they're always exploring their options. And I feel like you're deciding here to not fight for this anymore with the Seven of Wands in reverse. Some of y'all, they weren't fighting for this enough. And that was the problem. Show me the Three of Swords. The Page of Swords in reverse. This person could have lied to you, I'm getting. And here's the High Priestess again, your Major Arcana card. I feel like you're able to, um, if, when, if this person did try to lie to you or try to make you think something that wasn't it, I feel like you were able to see through it immediately. Uh, with the high priestess coming out twice that's somebody that see right through you hello like you go from within like spirit just knocks you off with breaks you off with knowledge non-stop so i feel like a lot of y'all this person if they tried i feel like you were able to catch on yeah let me see the world some of y'all even got people other people that are interested in you Show me the world card, please. The queen of wands in reverse. Oop, some of y'all that had to do with somebody else. Nine of cups. 
the seven of swords in reverse with the six of wands again i'm getting the six of wands for y'all today has to do a lot with y'all own self-esteem your own self-confidence and i feel like a lot of y'all had to make this decision because it was like i love myself way more than this like i know my worth like i'm not about to sit here and deal with certain shit that i know i don't deserve you know what i'm getting like it was about your happiness with the nine of cups like and I don't think this person was making you feel happy with whatever it is they were doing, they were giving you. They weren't making you feel confident either with the Queen of Wands in reverse. Seven of Cups. Mm. Exploring your options. Some of y'all like, nah, I'm about to date. <laughs> I'm about to see what else is out here. You got this twice in a row. Let me see the Eight of Cups. What, what, about, what about, what is this? Abandonment, just walking away. Show me the Eight of Cups. knight of wands oh this person look good oh shit the hangman in reverse the six of wands i like how you keep getting that card judgment in reverse mm, your person look good because the knight, the knight of wands in his deck whoo he look good i'm gonna tell you that right now hey hey knight of wands in his deck look real good but in this deck this knight of wands is a problem starter do you hear me I mean, this is somebody who I forget what, what um, God he's supposed to be in this because this is like Greek mythology or whatever. But I forget who he's supposed to be. But this is the guy. This is this is somebody that was starting a lot of shit and they banned him to the desert. And he was still sharp starting shit in the desert. But uh, yeah, this person look real fucking good. I'm telling you. But they they a shit started for some of y'all. They fucking put you through it i mean mm, they got a nice body and all that but whoo jesus you know what i'm saying judgment in reverse hangman in reverse it was like and you keep getting that six of wands which is my energy about like see queen of wands in reverse they was getting on your nerve or some of y'all they had somebody else because that queen of wands in reverse can mean the other woman other man i'm telling you y'all went through a lot here Now, let's see your person. Show me the tower. Five of pentacles in reverse. Ace of wands in reverse. Show me the tower, please. And the king of swords in reverse. Woo! Mm, and the page of wands in reverse. This person immature, huh? Some of y'all, they just not on your level, like mature wise, or like what you looking for, what you want in the like future wise. Like something came out here and was revealed here. Um, and I think it really would, this is really what allowed you to make this decision. Strength in reverse. Was this person even working hard for this? Were they even trying to make this work, Pisces? Were they even, or were you putting in most of the effort? I remember I used to work with this girl, Jennifer, and she told me she was messing with this guy. She would pay for the hotel, pay for the weed, pay for the food, drive to his, I'm like, bitch. Only thing you missing is him paying, is you paying him for dick. Like, damn, you gonna pay for everything? So I'm not saying that that's, oh, I'm not saying that's all of y'all Pisces, but there's a Pisces I'm talking to. This nigga wasn't doing shit, male or female. I mean, they was, you was doing it all. You had the gas, you had the food, you had the weed, you had the fucking, fucking, um, shelter. Some of y'all is an Aquarius, a Libra, or Gemini. Let me see the two of wands. Nine of Swords. Ooh. Five of Pentacles in reverse. And the Six of Wands in reverse. With the Four of Swords. Yeah, I'm seeing some silence here. I feel like some of y'all, this person had one foot in, one foot out. One foot in with you, one foot out with somebody else, if you know what I mean. Um, but for others of you, I just feel like 
I mean, I feel like this person know they fucked up, especially if you walked away or or whatever, or they could feel your energy shifting. I feel like they know they fucked up. I feel like they know they taking an L here with the six of wands in reverse. Notice you kept getting this shit upright. They're getting it reversed. Like, that's about taking an L, like feeling like a failure. Like, they know they fucked up. You know what I mean? I think they do want to be in good graces with you with the five of pentacles in reverse here again. But, um... Queen of Wands. Yeah, they know you look good. They know you the shit. Like, they fuck with you. Somebody here got a lot of cats, too. Because this Queen of Wands and this deck got like one, two, three. She got mad cats around her. So somebody here got a lot of cats, I'm getting. I love cats. Also, you, I'm getting Pisces. If you're a female, you got a lot of like women around you that like really admire you. Like, they like what you're about, how you dress, like, your, your confidence, things like that. Like, you inspire a lot of women around you. Or if you're a male, you do that with men. Let me see the Three of Wands. The Three of Cups in reverse. The Eight of Cups. Whoa. And if they keep getting that Five of Pentacles in reverse with the Page of Swords. So here's the walking away here. Maybe both of y'all did. Maybe both of y'all decided here to split. Um, I feel like this person is... Some of y'all, they waiting for you to come back. Or they think you're going to come like right back. Show me the Five of Pentacles in reverse. This keeps coming out. The Six of Wands in reverse. This is like this person don't want to... I feel like this person knows that you are something special. Like, I feel like they know that you're something strong. Like, they know you're something that's worth having around. Like, you're someone worth having around in the long term. But, and that can be why this person is, because their energy is not like they're trying to, like, they want you to leave. I don't think they want you to leave. I think they want you, the two of you guys, to be on good terms here. I think they want to be in your life. But I feel like they also, some of y'all, this person want to go out, party, drink. Go to the club, shit like that. Some of y'all, they friends or somebody's influencing their decisions here. I'm seeing a lot of fake people around this person. A lot of fake friends, fake family members. Whoever they got in their company, I don't trust their company. Let me see the chariot in reverse. Cancer energy here. Whoa, what just popped out here? The Eight of Pentacles in reverse, the Justice card, and the, the Knight of Swords in reverse. That just popped out on its own with the Queen of Wands. There you go again. Um, I feel like if you did walk away, this person kind of feel like they deserved it. I'm not going to lie. Well, whoever walked away, somebody deserved it. Show me the Chariot in reverse. Four Cups in reverse. There's that Eight of Pentacles again in reverse. That's what popped out. And the Empress. Woo! And the Hermit. Yeah, they fuck with you. Whoever this is, they real attracted to you. I'm not going to lie. Especially if sexual energy is off the chart here. I definitely am picking up on some sexual energy between you and them. Some of y'all, this person is married. Or they got a baby mother, a baby father, some shit like that. And that could be a problem. That's not for everybody. Uh, but there's something here that's causing this, this situation to be at a halt with the chariot in reverse. Um, person is very, very attracted to you. I mean, physically, they think you're the shit. You know what I'm saying? That's one thing you ain't got to worry about. But I feel like there is... Um, some of y'all are older than this person too or you're, you're coming up like you're more mature or some shit like that. Whatever the case may be, it's like... This person is not really putting in much effort I'm getting. I feel like they're going to message you, especially if you walked away and you haven't heard from this person in a while. I feel like they're going to hit you up with the page of wands being the overall energy. This person is coming up like a young energy, like a fun energy, like trying to have a good time. You know what I mean? Some of y'all, this person is still in the club, still hanging out. You know what I mean? They may be still trying to explore options and things like that. Meanwhile, you're pulling high priestess energy, which is a way more mature, grown woman, grown man type energy. So I feel like there's a lot of passion between the two of you guys. But I just don't know. Temperance card is here too. So some of you, it's a Sagittarius. I just don't know, like, 
if this person is what you want long term you know what i mean like i feel like they fulfill you sexually i feel like they fulfill you they make you feel good i'm not seeing anything here even about like love you know what i mean like i'm not seeing any emotions i'm not seeing any you know no barely any cups cards came out you know what i mean which are about my emotions you know what i mean i'm not really seeing that but i feel like there's a lot of passion a lot of fire between the two of you guys um and i don't feel like it's the end i don't feel like it's over i feel like i see you you're like it's over i'm walking away i'm done but i feel like your person is still kind of lingering on a little bit um and i see some communication coming in with the page of wands so we're gonna go into the extended um let me try one more thing hold on judgment is here too How does Pisces feel about this person? Times are good, bad. Hermit in reverse. Virgo energy. The Ace of Pentacles. Seven of Swords in reverse, and then you got the Ten of Pentacles in reverse. There's a problem here with stability with this person. Six of Swords. That's you moving on. I told you. Like, some of y'all are really, like, sailing away. Hermit in reverse is, like, isolation, keeping your distance. Some of y'all are trying to look for something or moving in a different direction because you want something more stable. And I feel like this person has a problem with stability. I do. Some of y'all don't trust this person either with the seven of swords in reverse. There could have been some type of something here this person could have done or past behavior that showed you maybe you can't really trust this person. All right. So let's go into the extended. Now I'm going to pull your person's cards in the extended. See how they feel about you. What actions they're going to be taking moving forward. And what is your advice from the universe as far as how to move forward with this person. Okay, Pisces. I love y'all. Thanks for watching. Y'all take care and I'll see y'all in the extended. If not, I'll see y'all next time. Enjoy your week. Love ya.